Hey, Eric here, um, and welcome to my channel. So my mission is really to help people without financial background to master investing and target 30% from the market uh, through a coaching program. So in this video, I just want to walk through one of my successful trade, kind of explain, you know, what happened um, and how to think about it uh, and, you know, what is the results so far. So the stock we're currently looking at is Electronic Arts uh, and it is a gaming company. It has quite a few good games or well, some people might disagree, uh, but it has a lot of brands under the company's belt. Now, if you look at this chart uh, and let me just hide all the indicators here for you, just to give you a feeling of what I did, I entered here near around $82, $86. And then afterwards, uh, the stock just went up for the next 14 months and right now is $110 um, and I took my second profit. So as you can see, there's like this huge drop here, uh, which, you know, caused a great discount. And um, after doing research in the company, uh, which I'll, I'll explain further, um, I got in at this price, which is quite a good price when you look at the, when you look at the historically, you know, the price has been going up above 100 and so on. Uh, so uh, in terms of stats, here's the stats. I entered at around November 2018, and my second exit is January 2020. So uh, as I'm recording this video for you, it's actually just this week. So my return on the second position is actually 63.4%. And in terms of dollar amount, I realized um, $6,212, and this is what I took in terms of profit alone this week. So then um, I also exited a little bit earlier, uh, which is kind of around here at around $106. And my profit is $3,518 last month, uh, which is when I took the profit. And then I also have an unrealized amount, which I'm currently still holding on to, of $7,763. So in total, uh, my gain uh, for this stock is $17,493. So I gotta say for the amount of capital I invested in, I, I earn around, around 50, 60% on this. Uh, so the gain is pretty good. So how did, how did I make this trade? You know, what made it successful and how can you potentially repeat it for yourself? Um, I'm gonna try to cram a lot of concepts within this video. Uh, and just explain this trade alone. Of course, if you want more details, um, you can go into the description and there's more details there. So when you look at this stock, EA, you know, it's a very strong company, it's blue chip, it's basically number one uh, gaming company in the world. Um, and, you know, during that time in 2018, there was a lot of bad press. A lot of people are unhappy of the company um, and, you know, there was regulation impacting the company because of the whole loot box uh, problem. And I think Belgium at that time was banning loot boxes and basically saying that it's not allowed anymore because of, you know, people spending so much money on it. And the stock price just keep going down and down and down. And everyone is, you know, basically hating on EA. But that doesn't change the fact that EA is fundamentally a very strong company. It doesn't change the fact that when you do your fundamental analysis, you will find that EA is growing. And it doesn't change the fact that when you compare EA with its peers, like you know other gaming companies, it is considered to be undervalued. So, you know, that's what I really talk about in my coaching program is you know distortion, manipulation, and basically disastrous events. And this is a very good example of it. And if you take some time and research during that period, you're going to find a lot of bad press uh, for EA during that time. But it doesn't change the fact that when you start doing your fundamental analysis and so on, EA is a great company. So that's how I got this kind of return by investing at a dip. And then afterwards, you know, it's, it's pretty passive. Um, once you enter at a good time, once you find the right company, once you wait until it is a good time to enter, um, it's pretty much hands off from there. Uh, so you might wonder, 
the stock price went from around $82, $83 to $106 to $110, right? And if you calculate the return, the return is actually not that high. So 106 divided by, uh, let's do 111 divided by around 83. It's only a 33% increase in terms of absolute dollar value. So how come I'm able to make 63.4%? Um, and this is really where the magic comes in. And the magic is stock options. I use stock options as a way to multiply my profit. Now, stock options is not a very popular concept. Not a lot of people know about it um, or use it effectively even. But if you know how to use stock options effectively, which I would consider this to be an advanced topic, then you can use it to multiply your return. And that's why I can get such a return. Um, so yeah, so that's actually um, how I executed this trade. And right now, obviously, EA is performing very well. You can see the stock price is going up. It's releasing new games. And one of the more notable games is actually Star Wars Fallen Order. Uh, so, you know, I personally bought it and I have been playing it. I've been enjoying it. So I think, you know, it's a great game. Um, and I think that is one of the reasons why the stock price is going up. And I also think that, you know, the upcoming E3 conference um, is like a driver that caused the stock price to go up as well. Uh, so that definitely, you know, plays a part of it. Now you'll notice, you know, I'm talking a lot about the qualitative side of things, you know, how the news is impacting it, how the regulation is impacting it, how, you know, upcoming events might be impacting the stock price. But I actually combined this with technical analysis and fundamental analysis. And it's really powerful when you are able to combine multiple analysis together and then use stock options to multiply your profit. So I think this is a really good case study uh, because, you know, obviously there is quite a good profit here. I've already profited around almost 10K here, 9.7K. And then I have another seven to 8K that is still uh, currently unrealized. Uh, so we're just waiting to see if EA will go further up. So that's pretty much it for this um, trade. Hopefully you learned something useful from it and you can apply it to your portfolio as well. If you want to learn more, you can always watch the free webinar that is in the description below. Good luck.